Exactly. And what is the deal between the president and Slurpees? Why does he, why does he <laughs> in every speech he's portraying it as the, uh, the official drink of obstructionist Republicans? <laughs> well, after your fourth email, I went to talk to him about the tater tots, Mark, and um, I, now, he's, now he's hooked on Slurpee, so I, don't, uh, I'll, I will go ask him that as well. They drove our economy into a ditch. And we got in there and put on our boots, and we pushed and we shoved, and we were sweating. And these guys were standing, watching us, and sipping on a Slurpee. It was hot down there. We've been pushing the car, shoving it, sweating. They're standing on the sidelines, sipping a Slurpee. Mark, you also have some interesting f numbers on something else that you've been following as you follow everything, as I know, sitting there every day watching you do it, on the president and Slurpees? Now, you'd, you'd, you'd think that would be the last two words you would see in the same sentence, but President Obama has now made reference to that icy, slushy drink that you get at convenience stores, Slurpees, in 20 of his speeches. What's that all about? What's the association of Republicans with Slurpees? I mean, Slurpees are certainly not an elitist drink. It's not like, you know, Chardonnay. Sipping on a Slurpee, watching us do all the work. But you'd see the Republicans standing there, fanning themselves. <laughs> Sipping on a Slurpee. Fanning themselves. Sipping on a Slurpee, just... And, and every once in a while, we'd, we'd look up and see the Republicans up there, looking comfortable, fanning themselves, <laughs> sipping on Slurpees. They're just standing there fanning themselves, <laughs> sipping on a Slurpee. The whole time, the Republicans are standing up there, comfortable, <laughs> sipping on a Slurpee, watching us. They're, they're just standing there, sip, sipping on a Slurpee. And... Um, in the in the president's uh, car ditch slurpy metaphor, that he's been using, <laughs> um, he says that the um, the idea here is that, it that it, as Mark appropriately pointed out, it now includes lattes. And Having a latte. We see a lot of self-appointed leaders uh, who are long on rhetoric, but uh, short on substance.